Hey again, this is Robert with Clean Pool and Spa. And in this video, I want to teach you how to take your calcium hardness using the K2006 pool water test kit. Now, if you don't have this, um, I suggest you get it because it's the most accurate and um, it's going to give you the actual numbers. All right. So first off is I'm going to open this up. And if you get lost or confused or anything, the directions uh, are right on here and everything is color coded with the bottles here. Now for the calcium harness, I'm going to use uh, these three blue bottles right here. So first off is you take your vial. If you notice, there's a larger one and a smaller one. The smaller one is, is for cyanuric acid. So I'm going to focus um, uh, the attention today on the calcium harness. You're going to use the large one. Okay. And um, how you get your, your pool water test is you hold the vial upside down, you go straight in about up to your elbow, flip it back up again and come straight back up. Not not this uh, big windmill stuff because that's pretty useless and, and it looks impressive but it does nothing. So I'm going to come down here and take the pool water test. Now on your vial right here has measurements for the mills. This is the 44 and 25 mil. You want to get it the 25 mil right here. So what you're going to do is just tilt it like this and you're going to watch this water coming right here and once it gets down to this 90 mark on the bottom of the vial, so keep going right there, once it gets down to there you flip it back up and you hit the 25 mil mark. So that's a very easy way to do it. So first thing I'm going to do is this is the R0010, this is a calcium buffer. and this takes 20 drops, so I'm going to put 20 drops in. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eleven, twelve, fifteen, fourteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, twenty. Alright? When you put the, the drops in, be sure that they're straight up and down, not to the side. Okay? If you put them, drop them to the side, you're not going to get an accurate reading. So then you swirl to mix. Now when you swirl the mix, you don't want to hold it down here and slosh it around or hold it up here and slosh it around because that does nothing. You want to get that, you want to get a good swirl in, it just, you want to get a good vortex going in there. So you hold it up here and just swirl. Now this is the calcium indicator, the next one, the, R, the R0011. So come over here. And we're going to put in five drops. One, two, three, four, five. And swirl to mix. And, and hopefully you can see that swirling in there. But that's what you want to do. You want to get that good swirl. That's why you can't hold it like this and just slosh it around because it does nothing. All right. So the next one, now you're fine. So, so the next one is the hardness reagent. Now this is going to, oh, this is going to change color. This is pink and it's going to change to blue and I'm just going to add this so we hold it right at eye level. It's always eye level and just start adding these drops and you're counting. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29. All right, and it looks like it's starting to change colors. And this is 30. And there you go. That is, well, let's do one more. 30, 31. And that's a nice blue right there. So I put in 31 drops. So you just multiply that times 10. And the hardness is 310. Now, because we live in Florida, the fill water is a little bit hard. Um, really, the only thing that you can do is either do a, um, a draining refill or maybe get some water trucked in, uh, pool water delivery. So that's how you test your calcium using the K2006 pool water test kit. So just toss that to the side. Don't throw it back in the pool. Rinse your vial out, and you're done. So, I'm Robert with Clean Pool and Spa. Uh, please check the description box below, a link to my website, cleanpoolandspa.com. Lots of great information 
over there. Hope this helped you out. Uh, please like, subscribe, and comment. Be safe and happy swimming. Bye.